This is Goddard's, built by Mr. Edwin Lutyens for Mr. Frederick Mirrelees as a home of rest for ladies. To it come, at his invitation, those ladies to whom the strain of work or want of private means renders such a visit a source of rest and refreshment for mind and body. Ladies of small means, nurses from the hospitals, exhausted by care for others. Beautiful, isn't it? Welcome to Goddard's. You know, I have to pinch myself sometimes. Can't really believe I'm here. A home of rest for ladies, courtesy of the Mirrelees family. My name's Lily Ingle, and as you can see, I'm a nurse. You can usually find me at the London Hospital in Whitechapel. I'm going back today. I hope it's a tear in my eye. It's been so lovely here. Well, it's not like me to be sentimental. Let's go in. We'll make our way through my favourite place, the Courtyard Garden. It's so beautiful and such a pleasure just to sit outside in good weather and enjoy the fresh air and the sunshine and the scent of the flowers. Oh, it's a bit different to the East End, I can tell you. When you've been working 13 hour shifts at the hospital, sweeping and mopping all the ward floors, bringing in scuttles of coal, boiling and scrubbing all the medical equipment and more, it feels quite heavenly to rest a while. It's just as beautiful inside as well. This is the common room. I can't believe I'm able to be in a place like this. When I first arrived, I kept going in and out, sitting first in the garden, then coming in and sitting in the common room and looking up at the high ceiling, then going back out into the garden again. I'm so lucky to be here, you see. There's only room for six ladies at most to stay here. At the moment, there are two other nurses and two governesses. There's an attic room upstairs too, where we can go in wet weather. and We have a good time together talking and reading, and there can be music and games as well. There's another place to play games too, which is perhaps even more exciting. This is the Skittle Alley, where I've learned that I have a good eye and a good aim. The man who built it came here too. Mr Lutchins, he said his name was. He played a game of Skittles with us. It was all very jolly. He said he loved to use the things that he had made. Now, I was puzzled at the fact that there's no door in the outside wall of the Skittle Alley. So I asked him, why not? And <laughs> did he forget? He laughed and said that it's so that in the winter time, the villagers can come in and play a game of Skittles and enjoy a pipe and a glass of beer. This really is a very special place. So as I take my leave, I just wanted to show you this. It's a stone above the main doorway, MCM. It's 1900 in Roman numerals, but it's also the initials of Mr. Mirrelees' young daughter, Margaret Celia Mirrelees. Mr. Mirrelees made this house as a gift for her. So I suppose I've been her guest all the time I've been here. Well, sadly, it's time for me to go now, but I hope that someday you two are lucky enough to stay here. And if you are, I wish you as wonderful a time as I've had. 